Today we're talking about the Hydrologic Mini ARCS. ARCS stands for Automated Reclaim Condensate System. This is not reverse osmosis. This is literally designed for reclaiming water off your condensate, your dehumidifier and your air conditioner. So what I've done, I've replaced the fitting on the inlet to 3 8 because we have a 3 8 booster pump. So the hose is slightly larger than the, one, than the one it comes with. It comes with a quarter inch, we've boosted up to 3 8 The outlet is quarter inch going into the UV sterilizing component. That's this piece right here and I'll show you that. It literally pops off and unthreads here. And there is a UV bulb in there and the ballast is right back here. So we wanna make sure that there's no water that ever gets on that ballast. And the UV bulb is very, very dangerous to look at. So make sure you never directly turn this on and stare at it. UVC uh, is designed for killing bacteria and pathogens. And uh, that's exactly what this part of the unit does. So uh, how this unit works, and that threads right back on there like that, and want nice and snug, takes the condensate water that we're collecting in a reservoir, we're gonna be running into a booster pump, which pressurizes that water. Coming in, it goes through a sediment filter. This is gonna remove all the gunk and the crap, sand and anything. Then it goes into a metal filter, and this is gonna be designed for removing metals, heavy metals, lead, ferrous metals, iron, aluminum, copper, all these types of metals uh, to make sure that we're not refeeding our plants uh, those heavy metals. It's very, very important. A lot of inexpensive dehumidifiers don't go into uh, making sure that the runoff is very, very low. I know Quest is one of the things that drew, drew me to the product to begin with. They initially did testing to make sure that any of the runoff has extremely low levels of aluminum and copper. So we want to make sure that we're not refeeding our plants those type of heavy metals to make sure that nutrition for those plants are as clean and safe as possible. Next thing it goes into is a pH neutralizer. This filter makes the uh, water quite acidic. This one re-neutralizes it and it will change the pH. It'll also change your PPM. It'll bring it up by about 30 to 40 parts per million. Uh, in this case, uh, we're not gonna be using this filter. Uh, for If we were using it for refeeding the plants, it's gonna bring your pH to about 7, 7.4. I want to make sure that uh, in this case, I don't want any PPMs because we're going to be running directly from the arc system into our humidifier, our ultrasonic ideal air humidifier. And I want to make sure that that water does not contain any PPMs of anything. It's going to be basically distilled, pure, clean, filtered, and UV sterilized water. So simply, um, I'm going to be mounting this whole unit below the power line to make sure that all my water is below the electrical outlets in the building. Grab your drill, take this off so I can see where level is. Put that right there. I've already pre-drilled a couple holes. And that was good there. One end and then we'll level it. You want to make sure that you don't mount this directly at ground level for obvious reasons because you need a little bit of space underneath it to level, which it is. Nice and tight, nice and snug, completely level. Dang. So simply to plumb it in, we're going to put our booster pump, that's this animal right here, in the reservoir, simply push fittings, turn it on, have it come into the ARCS sediment filter, and these are very simple. When you install these, you want to make sure that uh, the only thing is there's no burrs, you want to make sure it's smooth, the pipe. 
this snug, nice and tight. Water comes through the sediment, through the metal filter and through the neutralizing pH filter. We're gonna remove this filter right now. Simply grab your trusty filter wrench, unthread that. Take that out. And before you pressurize the whole system, you wanna make sure, just snug quarter turn. Before you pressurize the whole system, you wanna make sure there's no leaks. So everything gets snugged up and tightened. The quarter inch water line goes into the UV sterilization. Upgraded this a little bit to the 3 8 line going in and out of the system. Push that in, nice and snug. And that is gonna go along the wall. We'll mount it nice and cleanly. We now have the power for the UV light right here and the power for the booster pump. We're gonna plug those in in a second. Happy gardening. Thanks for watching.